this house, it's different, but at the same time, it kind of captures the primal nature of the environment in which it's located. Hi, I'm Brian. Hi, I'm Denise. Welcome to Truo Bruges, which is Old English for Tree Bridge. When we first went to the architect, we, we had some ideas in mind. And We've kind of lived in more traditional homes over the years, and we thought, you know what, this is going to be modern. One of the reasons we did, um, you know, go to see Omar was because of his modern designs. Omar Gandhi, a very respectful guy and very uh, talented. We came out here with the sketches that he'd produced, and we went, wow, yeah, that's, that's the house. It's like a fortress, but it's also very warm and cozy, very livable. And it's respectful of the environment. I think that's, that's an important thing, too. And of the history of the area. You know, the, the roof, it's called a gambrel roof. It's reminiscent of the barns that dominate the farm landscape around here. It was very important for us to have a fireplace, and we came up with uh, the slate. Most of the rock on this peninsula is slate, and so it looks like we brought nature inside. There are a lot of built-in cabinets. The TV is hidden behind the barn door. The wood is warm and rich looking. And then you have the contrast of the big steel beams. I, I love that idea, I love that industrial look. It makes that entranceway even more dramatic. This is one of the, it was one of the most important rooms as far as I was concerned. I love to cook, um, been in the restaurant business. But what I wanted was a kitchen where everything was easily accessible. The cabinets are very, um, they're very dramatic. In the morning, they're very bright and blue, and at night, they sort of transitioned into a, almost a black. And another feature that you know incorporates the blue is the back-painted glass on this countertop. And uh, we put a soapstone sink in the kitchen. It just makes such a statement. We've been coming to Nova Scotia for, what, 10 years? 10 years, yes. And the scenery here just caught our imagination. We like to spend as much time as we can outdoors, so it was important to have an area that was user-friendly, but protected from the elements. But of course, that's what this house is about, is, is not fighting nature, but taming nature. We're always going, oh my God, look at that. <laughs> <laughs> and we never tire of it. This is really peaceful and really relaxing, and it's good for the soul. I feel very connected to the land. You become sort of part of it. You watch the weather, you can see it changing hour by hour practically, and it's, yeah, it's, it's very, it's, it's an amazing place. Yeah.